What's up ladies and gentlemen, this is the Ibanez Obsession back again for another Pokemon 5th generation Wi-Fi battle. And as you can hear, I'm feeling a bit better. Um, still recovering my voice a little bit, but it's pretty good. So anyways, I'm finally back for a battle, and I just hit 200 subs, yay! So thank you guys, and stuff. But that wasn't, my, the real milestone was 250, so when 250 comes around, we're going to do something even better than this. But this is basically a Pokedex roulette battle. What happens in this is... You get a random Pokemon, and uh, or you get a random number generator to generate six numbers for you, one through six forty-nine, and you use those as your team. The first one has to be your lead. I just happened to get a Glalie, and he happened to get a Ludicolo. Now this is hilarious because uh, he let me use Glalie's uh, Dream World ability, which is um 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 Moody. Anyways, that's banned, but yeah. Anyways, I predicted him to go for something, and I have pregnancy, so yeah, I'm very moody. Get it? Yeah. Okay. Um, women that watch this, don't kill me. Anyways, um, so he's gonna switch now because he can't do anything, and he goes into his Haxorus, and that's pretty messed up to get. And I'm gonna set up my spikes. Um, and yeah, this happens every turn I get pregnant. So yeah, this is the second time in about one minute that I got pregnant. So that's hilarious. Anyways, Ice Beam and uh, yeah, even Haxorus takes that because it's Haxorus. Like seriously, look at that. It, but I get the freeze hacks, which is hilarious. Um, and now I'm just gonna completely abuse this ability. And now I break the evasion clause right here. And you know that was pretty funny. So, I'm going to set up my spikes again, because I need a second layer up, and once again, I'm going to see what this does. This time, I happen to get a plus two accuracy, but I lose some speed. And I'm still faster than this thing, which is really messed up. More pregnancy. Oh my goodness, this is like the fifth time. I don't even know, sixth time? And now my speed raises, but my evasiveness falls, so... Now I'm going to taunt it for no r good reason. I was thinking he would like Dragon Dance, but he's still frozen solid, so... I'm going to stop screwing around with him right now and just kill him, because I did happen to get a special attack raise, but also a speed lower, and, and he's still faster than me. I mean, I'm still faster than him. Yeah, anyway, so this is a pretty broken ability, and now you know why it's banned. Uh, yeah, pregnancy, nice. Anyways, more special attack rising, and that's plus four right now. And in comes Fatty, the Snorlax, which I would have called Meat Locker. I predicted him to go for the curse, thinking I wouldn't taunt, but he just goes straight for a fire punch, and, um, well, yeah, Glalie takes that, even though I've, uh, got, like, minus, I believe it was minus one defense. I don't know, I can't keep up with all these pregnancies. Look at that, I've been pregnant seven times already, or eight, or, oh my god, now I just broke the evasion clause again. And I'm gonna go for the ice beam, but Snorlax is just a beast, and even at plus three, that does nothing and body slam and uh, well I just got taken down by a meat locker anyways I fainted so now uh, he's gonna heal off of his leftovers which is great for him but it's not good for me because now he's healing off of lefties get in there Mega Man and uh, yeah it was pretty cool that I got a Metagross in a Pokedex roulette battle whereas he got the Haxorus but anyway in comes Yon Mega and uh, I'm gonna set up my stealth rock now so this is kind of a defensive team a little bit because I got Got all the entry hazards and whatnot. Now he goes for a hidden power. Uh, apparently that was supposed to be ground, but it's rock, so fail. Anyways, meteor mash, bam, and um, yeah, that kind of hurt it. Now I go for the bullet punch, uh, and I get a crit. And I actually did run damage calculators and everything. There was a 90% chance that I was going to kill it right here without the uh, crit. So. Yeah, calm down, Georgie, you know, this was my game. Anyways, thinking I would switch, he sends in this Tyranitar, but uh, I'm going to stay in, <laughs> which is pretty funny, and he's like, why did you stay in against a Tyranitar? It's like, well, I can take any non-stabbed attack from that thing, so I just stayed in and meteor mashed it, and I got the attack raise, which is great. But I kind of felt bad for sweeping, so I decided to back down here as he sends in his Surda Wuda and just uh, switch back out. So, yeah. I wanted it to actually be fun. So I'm going to go into my Ducky, which is Big Pex, and Bye Bye Weather, and um, Low Kick. And uh, this actually does a surprising amount of damage, even though Gold Duck doesn't weigh a lot. So, obviously, that Pseudo Wudo would have done a lot of damage to me. And I'm just going to go for the Surf. And, um,. Once again, I get the critical hit, 
And uh, and once again, Georgie like complains and thinks that it mattered, but guys, that's a spec surf. Uh, super effective. No. Anyways, Spatty again. And uh, this pretty much shows how defensive this thing is. This is again a stabbed choice specs earth or er, surf. Look at that. He lives with like I don't even remember how much he told me. It was like nine HP or something. I don't know, but that was very messed up, and now Snorlax is gonna fall asleep and I can't do anything. However, he does not he's not running that resto chesto gig, so I can just switch the heck out here and bring in my Doctor Doom Hound Doom. And um now I'm gonna bite him with my crunches. And uh this is actually a mixed um Hound Doom. And now that I switch back out, my bye bye weather has disappeared, so fail. Anyways, yeah, so this is a mixed one, and it got, it, it got, go and get him. Um, it, it has overheat, uh, what is it? I, I, I don't even know what it has anymore. It has crunch, overheat, I believe, flamethrower, uh, flare blitz, flare blitz. Okay, something like that. Anyways, it looks to be a two-hit KO, but he just happens to wake up right now and body slam me to oblivion. So, uh... <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh. Still got to cough a little bit, but you know, it's all good. Anyways, yeah, so he wakes up and just body slams me to death, which kind of sucks. Where's my watch? Yeah, it's like two minutes before I have to go to school, so this is funny. Anyways, I bring in my Shubarugo, or one of the... Oh my goodness. I got the Japanese names stuck in my head. Shub Shubarugo. Shubaru Shubaru um, and I go for the pursuit, thinking he'd switch, and I get another crit, oh my goodness. And, uh, that, I pretty much know, uh, he would've, well, I don't, I have no idea, I mean, it was 40 base power, and it wasn't stabbed, but it is banded, so, and Snorlax isn't, doesn't have the best physical defense, so, I guess it all depends. Anyways, Bob faints, and, um, now six foot hacks here is getting like wrecked, and uh, if you don't get that joke, six foot hacks is Mexican, so that's why he's the Lou Dicolo. Anyways, in comes Mega Man, and I'm screwing around here because I thought it would be funny to screw around right now, and uh, yeah. So, anyways, I get Hydro pumped in the face, but uh, look at this Mega Man taking it. Like seriously, that that's that's a Hydro pump from a Lou Dicolo, and he lives it like a beast. And I go for the bullet punch, thinking I could screw around and whatnot, but then he goes for the Giga Drain, and I was like, well, that was kind of a waste of a turn, but then I live again, and, uh, quite unfortunate for him, but, you know, now I can stay around and just mess with him the whole time. The good news is I do not take Sandstorm damage, because I would have died right there from the Sandstorm. Meteor Mash! And, uh, he's gonna live, sadly. And, uh, and then he's going to go for the Giga Drain again, which kind of really doesn't make a difference, because uh, he's barely going to regain any HP. That's like 4 HP. So big deal. Anyways, ugh, the Sandstorm does not take him out. And that means I have to screw around again. So I bring in my big pecs, thinking I can take him out with a, like, negative 4 effective surf because it's like negative four but I don't and he goes for the giga drain and now he's just gonna completely own my duck so um yeah anyways yeah okay nothing to say apparently so yeah and that was a fail and Skype popping up with the heck man oh my goodness Skype needs to stop popping up anyways um yeah so I'm going to send in my pedal to the metal, and this is like the first Pokemon I've had that has a messed up name. Anyways, as you can kind of like understand why I call it pedal to the metal, because instead of like the car pedal, it's flower pedal to the metal. Anyways, I defeated Georgie. Uh, that was a great battle, uh, Georgie. Multi-HDW, check him out in the description. Uh, great videos, you won't be disappointed, blah, blah, blah. He's actually uploading a lot more than I am because I've been sick and taking a break. And But now I'm coming back because I almost got 250 subs. So see you guys next time. Bye. And the screen went black.